Hi guys, welcome back. So glad you're joining me for another plan with me. This week, I have a special, special, special kit. Um, these were made by Miss Beth over at Beth Beauty and More. Um, she's been making planner stickers with her Cricut. And I commented on a video about how beautiful they were and how vintage and rosy. Yeah, I love these stickers. And I told her she needed to open a shop and she said, you know, she's too busy with everything else that she has going on. So I completely understand that. And then lo and behold, I got a surprise package in the mail, which I did a video. Um, I'll try to leave the link to the video down there or in a little iCard thingy. But she sent me the stickers that she made. <laughs> and... Um, so it's like a vintage rose kit that she made and she has seven um, decorative heart checklist, uh, some little half box ones, her weekend banner, um, headers, some decorative boxes, um, some checklists, some flags, little cameras, uh, laundry and snail mail and some trash cans up there. and. She does put a bleed around all of them so that um, if the cuts are off a little bit, see, there's a bleed, so that you still get color and you don't get any white space, which is very, very smart. So, because she plans in a Carpe Diem and it only has two full boxes and then a half box at the bottom, she doesn't create <clears throat> enough decorative boxes for an Erin Condren that has three rows of boxes. So, I've taken this paper, and I believe it's, it's the uh, Prima Marketing Romantique Collection, and this is Estella paper. And I got this at Hobby Lobby, like, forever ago. It's been hanging out in my scrap stash. So I took this paper, which I love. I've been hoarding it, as you can tell. Like I, I even hang on to like these kind of little scraps. I love it. Um, and because I love it so much, I felt it went with this kit. So I cut some full decorative boxes out of it. So I can throw those colors in. And then I had this sticker left from last week, oops, from my Spring is Sprung um, spread and the mint and pink. And I want to pull in some more mint so I can use this washi from Hobby Lobby. I just got this at Walmart. Um, it's the duck washi and it's in that light pink, which I got specially for this spread. And then I pulled this little thin washi. It came from a five set at Hobby Lobby. Oi, lots to go over. Um, I have some meal stickers. I have those Office Depot labels that I trimmed down to cover the dates. I have my um, butterfly date cover ups from Mila Print Shop. I have the Valentine sampler from Stella Paper Co. Still no idea when she's coming back, guys, or if. Um, I have the tiny label boxes from Mila Print Shop, and then I pulled everything that I had purchased from Stickerific in the February colors. Um, so I have lots of the like dusty roses and pinks to go with, because I plan a lot heavier than some people. <laughs> so we are going to go ahead and get started. As you can see, I do have a couple of things pre-planned. My kids have an eye doctor appointment and then I have an eye doctor appointment. So I'm just going to pull these post-its off. And these are the post-it brand post-its. That's why they kind of fit perfect in these squares. I'm just gonna stick them up there. And, oops, that's on Monday. I'm gonna stick them up at the very top above the days of the week. I have my Erin Condren ruler. Scissors, X-Acto knife, tweezers, um, G2 pilot, 
I don't know if I'll use a color because there's so many pinks and mints and everything. I think I'll use black so it stands out. Um, and then I'm going to need an adhesive. I don't know if I'm going to go with this like double sticky tape one or if I'm going to do the craft bond extra strength glue stick. I don't want to use something too liquidy so it'll either be this or this guy. I'll figure it out when I get there. All right, so that's everything that I have going on today. And per usual, I am going to fast forward, throw some music in, and we are going to plan from the 25th of April to the 1st of May. I can't believe it's May. I think I say that every time I'm in like the end of the month. I'm just like, where did this month go? I have no idea. But it's gone. So I uh, I will go ahead and get started. If you guys like playing with me videos, hit that thumbs up button. Don't forget to comment, like, which is the thumbs up, subscribe. Um, and if you really enjoy it and you think your friends would, go ahead and share it on your other social media. I don't mind. It would be a great help to my channel. Um, just so you guys know, I don't get anything for likes or comments or shares or subscribers. It's just basically if you like my channel, you just get to know when I upload some videos. So here we go. I will see you guys at the end.
All right, guys. So here is um, vintage sweet. Yeah, I'm gonna call it vintage sweet because I like it. The little cupcakes and butterflies and hints of glitter. I really, really like it. Beth, I love the kit. It was beautiful. Yes, you guys saw me struggling with the stickers, but she did say she's learning, and I am just so grateful. They all came up. There was no tearing. It was, you know, awesome. So I had to get creative. Like I said, she plans in a carpe diem, so there's only um, two full boxes and then a half box. So I was short half a box, basically. And she doesn't have a sidebar in her planner. So I had to build the sidebar. But um, the only thing that I added um, that wasn't a... Actually, that's, that's not true. Things that weren't Etsy stickers was... <laughs> This number one, because I didn't have a number one butterfly, so that is signifying May 1st in a big, bold, black one. Came from a sticker sheet from Dollar Tree. Um, these little cupcakes are from Hobby Lobby back at Valentine's Day. This, uh, the little do-it-all dots are from Erin Condren, and then everything else is Etsy stickers except for Miss Beth's kit. So, um, the coffee cups you saw me add to every day are from Stella Paper Co., the planners from Whimsical Flamingos Co., uh, the Payday's Craft Eva 2818, this is Stickerific, that's Stella Paper Co., all the labels and half boxes that you see are from Stickerific, the alarm clocks that you see are from Piper Paper Co., the day cover-ups are Mila Print Shop, the knife uh, fork and spoon stickers are from Imagine 320 Designs along with the medicine sticker. Other than that, I showed you guys everything else at the beginning of the video. If you enjoyed, please go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. I will leave a link to Miss Beth's channel down there in the description bar so that you guys can go check her out because she does weekly plan with me's as well. Um, and they're awesome. And she does this other video that's called uh, Saturday Snapshots, which I love. She basically vlog vlogs a little bit every day um, throughout the week and then compiles them all together and puts it up on Saturday. So that about covers it for me today, guys. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Again, hit the thumbs up, comment with any questions, subscribe and share it if you think your friends will like it and go over and check out Miss Beth because she's awesome. She does crafts and makeup and all kinds of girly stuff. So, anywho, love you guys. I will talk to you again soon. Bye for now.